And what did you do uh, with uh, Sir Laurence Olivier? I, I, did, I was going to do Coriolanus with him, and uh, they had such terrible time at the National Theatre. Um, it was, Larry was on his way so sort of slowly out when I was, <coughs> and it was such a backbiting scene back there. It was, it made the ballet world suddenly look like a sort of tame little shop at Sly Corner. Uh, it was, uh, everybody was backbiting, it was awful. And they had made a deal with the Germans <coughs> of the Berlin Ensemble to direct Coriolanus, which I, which I approved of, and Don Dex John Dexter recommended. We're in 1965 here? No, we're in, we're in 1969. 69. Yeah, the end of the 60s. And Larry was going to direct it, but John said, I called John up, I said, I don't want Larry to direct me in that. It's Coriolanus? I mean, he's played it. He just got the most astounding press. It's probably one of the great Coriolanuses of all time, hanging from his heels like Mussolini. I said, he's going to give me every frigging reading known to man. That's how he directs. He says, you know, he's going to, I'm going to be another copy of Olivier. Well, no, I don't want to do it. Who, can you do it, John? Because I love John Dexter. He was a wonderful director. John said, no, sadly, I'm busy, but I think you should have the Germans. And they'll be very good for the company because their presence will wake the company up. They're all rather lazy at the moment. They need, a, need somebody to shake them up. And then I said, that's great. Well, the first week, I'm, I'm rehearsing. I know it. I, I'm, I've learned most of Coriolanus, and I'm rehearsing it. And the, the directors are asleep at the back. I thought, what's the matter? They're not even directing. And I look at Dennis Quilly, who's playing Tellus of Phidias. I said, what's going on? He said, I don't know. Suddenly, the, the scripts arrive. It's not Shakespeare's play they've contracted us to do. It's Bertolt Brecht's Coriolanus. So now the scripts have arrived, and suddenly the Germans are interested. Now throw the books away, the Shakespeare's out, we are now going to do it, the Brecht play. So, so I went to Larry, I said, did you know anything about this? My God, Kit, no, I never heard of anything like that in my life. To, uh, call Ken Tynan, dear boy, call Ken Tynan. So I called Ken Tynan, I said, have you ever, no, never heard of it. They'd have been done it all behind their backs. Wow. The things were going on there that were unbelievable. Wow. So I didn't do Coriolanus. Couldn't do it, because of course, the Brecht version, Coriolanus' role is about that big. <laughs> and the mob is the star of right. the play, of right. course, of course. 